10 2 2016 quit being little girls hiding like bitches after they've seen a scary movie or son <laughs> get how there's a lot of dumb motherfuckers who say stupid shit like no one's heard of you. That's like me hiding behind social norms expecting people to think that I'm tough. Babylon's system makes me feel empowered. That doesn't mean I'm tough. Why don't martial artists get that? No one's gonna respect you. You hiding behind social norms and acting like the best martial artists aren't famous is like me hiding behind my badge like a bitch pretending that I could knock out Tyson. Shut up! So the other day I was explaining to a little kid outside of a martial arts school in San Jose, a Taekwondo school. And I said, yes, there's these guys who, you know, they just don't understand what martial arts means. That there's honor and discipline and that these are combat arts with weapons. And they think that UFC fighting or a street fight is the highest form of martial arts. And the kid was laughing and he was like, that's stupid. And I was just saying this to try to, you know, pick his mind before his parents said, who's this strange black guy talking to my kid, right? <laughs> and they got it like this, like this, just boom, right away. No questions asked. And I was like, yes. You know, I, I really don't think they have an excuse after that for pretending that my top martial arts challenge isn't the most relevant and put my money where my mouth is. These are transferable skills for combat. Little kids understand the relevance of sparring. Little kids understand the difference between some kind of knucklehead idiot that I would fucking seriously harm and a few with a few deadly blows maximum, you know, tops, and it'd be done, you know? and being a great warrior. Little kids understand the difference. So I refuse to go on anymore. You know, in fact, because they've been annoying me so much with this, and I'm tired of talking to nonsensical minds, on December 20th, also my key point challenge for thousand dollars, who can just, anyone who can disprove any key point in my videos will end as well. I'm sick of talking to inferior minds about these things. I'm sick of their stupid arguments. I'm sick of their lack of insight and understanding. Your inferior forms of life, period. And I, you know, first of all, I'd like to say that, you know, when it comes to this next topic, that no one should ever join the Islamic State. However, I would love to say that America is more righteous than ISIS, but I simply cannot. America is a terrorist state. It's a corporate terrorist, pharmaceutical, satanic, eugenic state. No matter how much of an, an extremist someone is from being uh, you know a muslim extremist that will never be as bad as being a fucking corporate terrorist soft killing millions then there's the pedophiles and all the other stuff and all the cognitive damage they cause with the big pharmaceuticals and so on you know autism being caused we have record rates of autism you know it doesn't take a genius to figure out what's going on here it all goes back to how they group developmental disorders with made up mental illness you know this is a sickness we see in America. We see dishonor and disgrace. I haven't seen such cowardice in my life as I've seen from people who are supposed to be brave, other martial artists, and some of them even go as far as to pretend to be on my side, trying to get me to pretend I'm not the best. So help me God on the Bible. I've done this before, I'll do it again. So help me a God on the Bible. I am the top martial artist in American history. There isn't a single martial artist in American history that I wouldn't be able to fucking murder in ancient combat. I would decimate these people and I would do it fumed and drugged, you know, as much as I've been, about as much as I've been. And certainly in my prime, I'm much better than the next best in American history. I'm the top martial artist, a man of God, and I'm sick of these little pitiful cowards, you know, and I'm, I'm so done with them. I'm so done with them. Little kids, so help me God, little kids understand my point. Little kids.
Little kids train weapons. Little kids understand these are combat arts from an ancient time that have self-defense applications, entertainment applications, but first and foremost, they're combat arts. If you don't understand that, shut up. Other martial artists are complete cowards who have proven they have no honor whatsoever, none. They could not rise to the occasion and do the right thing. They couldn't rise to the challenge and do the right thing. They've proven themselves to be mini-me corporate shells that benefit from America's eugenic propaganda. Complete fucking weaklings, and I hope I never see another one of them again because it disgusts me, the level of cowardice and pitiful dishonor they have stooped to. Let all history know, let all the world know, every version of history make clear that these are pussies who have acknowledged my point with their silence, but tried to make themselves seem better with their complicity with evil. Did that atheist guy really tell you to provoke me to go to the psych ward? Yes. Doesn't that seem out of the ordinary?